inflict a bit of damage on the home side here. Sayer floats it in right footed and it's flicked on the near post as far as Noble on the half volley who smashes it into the stand behind the goal. It's moving forward down the right hand side to Sayer. Sayer infield to Williams. Williams will float the ball up towards Carl Finnegan who thighs it down to Liam Noble 25 yards out. He goes out to Andrew Johnson looks across low and there's Carl Finnegan it's dead centre all the time in the world to just slot it into an empty net. And we are nine minutes, nine minutes in, and Town take an early lead. Now, who's it? Just inside Blythe territory, goes back to Chris Reed, and we're in our own half, but all the action's being played in Blythe's half at the moment. Ball over the top, looking to get... Oh, well, Foley's got there first, and he's able to turn on the ball on the edge of the air. He looks to Ben Bourne! Oh. Brilliant! Absolutely brilliant from Jack Foley. He finds the far top corner, and Morpeth have a two-goal lead here at Croft Park. That was just a, a moment of brilliance, 15 minutes in. And it's 2-0 in the early exchanges as Morpeth looked to build from the halfway line. Hoist up towards Foley, who knocks it down towards Finnegan, who feigns to shoot and finds Noble, who lays it into Finnegan, who's in the area. Chance to shoot. Great save from the keeper. And then the rebound is bundled into the side netting and out for a corner kick to 2-0 after 20 minutes. Corner will be hoisted in there. Flicked on at the near post. It is 3-0. Jack Foley scored again. It just dropped for him and he thighed it in at the back post. And Morpeth are pulling Blythe Spartans to pieces here at Croft Park, where it is 3 0 and Foley has a second. The next pass or just move the ball on a little bit more. Absolutely, Morpeth looking good for it, but they are playing against the out of sorts Blythe. Outfit here as the ball's played over the top, looking to release someone, but it's cleared by Connor Oliver. There's an open net. Dan Lawson's come all the way, and he's the number 11 has put it into the back of the net. And Blythe do have a goal to cheer for in the first half. Again, he chests it down. He's done well there to maintain possession. Then he plays it infield and, and releases Dale, who's 25 yards out. And he'll have a goal with his left. He steps inside and then has a goal with his right. And Dan Lawson gets a long way across his goal to push that one behind. And Gives it back to his left back, who moves it infield, 25 yards out. Looking to tee up the number four, is he going to have a go from range? He is, it's a good one, that's a crack and save, Lawson, who yeah. puts it onto the post, and then it's rolled in at the second time of asking by Panos. Here is Dan Lawson, he launches it long, up towards the head of Finnegan, he won't get there, just go over the top of him. Noble tries to win it, and he's moved out to the left-hand side, and Johnson, who gets up towards the edge of the area, checks his run, dinks it in, heads go up, Foley on a hat-trick, he loops it over the top, but... The ball's flicked on, and Liam Henderson could be in behind here, up towards the edge of the area, looks to find a yard of space to shoot, it's a good save, it was straight at him, but the keeper was on his way down, and Liam Henderson was through on goal, jockeyed for position, forced slightly out to the left, the shot was saved, and the corner is swung in towards the back post, and I'm not sure how that stayed out, going in front of the away dugout. The referee didn't look at that challenge. <laughs> no, he didn't. Um, here is Johnson there, who's a time to move forward in front of this away dugout, in front of his management team, goes in field to Henderson, who's 25 yards out, and will go for goal. He shoots low at that near post. Running 30 yards, then turning back again. Yeah, if Blythe were clever, they would have realised in the 10 minutes where they were on top, they were making the midfield do the work as Liam Henderson wins an aerial challenge, but it'll go back deep to Conor Oliver, who's out on the right hand side. And Kyle Williams plays in field, Ben Sayer moves it on, and then Jack Foley moves it further on. He's allowed to turn on that right hand side, and he may look to cross. He's surrounded by one, but he steps inside the challenge. Plays in field to Noble. Noble is here, 20 yards out. He shoots low across goal. It's lovely football from the highwayman. Here is Connor Oliver then in midfield, who gives it back to Ben Sear. Our cameraman does come out with some funny old lines. And he looks to play a long ball over the top, and Noble's going to get in behind him here. Drifts out to the right hand side. He's looking for options. He's got Henderson in there. He floats it in towards the area. It's headed up rather than out. And Chris Thackeray, Michael Nelson takes over and heads it straight to Liam Noble. 20 yards out. Looks to kill one, and it's gathered by the keeper. Ben Sear on the edge. Noble sends it in this time and the heads go, or drops at the back post for Foley, he's going to get a shot in, he does, it's blocked. Had to wait it to, had to, wait it to come out the sky for an age before he got a shot away but it's blocked and Ben Sayer picks up the loose ball on the edge of the box, sends an inviting ball in and it's headed clear though by Blythe's defence and then Conor Oliver should pick up that and doesn't. And he's, Will he get on the second ball? He does, he scraps for the ball in midfield and then doesn't get there and he's offside referee, he was a yard offside as they charge up towards the edge of the box and Blythe are they going to get a shot away he does and he flashes it wide of the near post but increasingly chilly night here in Blythe as the ball's hoisted in by the Spartans towards the back post he's dropped it down and a shot comes in from range and it's gathered by Dan Lawson who had a couple of minutes spell where they're a bit sloppy in possession here's Andrew Johnson who's 
Allowed a lot of space to turn. <coughs> moves it out to the right hand side. Williams who moves in field to say he's got 10 yards to move into. Finds Jack Foley. Foley gives it to Oliver and congested area in front of them. Here's Foley 20 yards out. Is he going to get a shot away just across to the right? And here's Andrew Johnson. Surely Callum Williams is going to look to cross. It goes back to Andrew Johnson. Will he cross? He dinks it in the area. Liam Henderson's glancing header across goal and it drifts past the far post. But once again, that is measured, methodical, and meticulous from Mortmouth in the build up. Mortmouth's partial clearance on halfway drops for a blithe man and the ball over the top is too heavy. And Dan Lawson should keep hold of the ball. And there is the final whistle, and Mortworth Town take a 3-2 victory from Croft Park against National League North Blythe Spartans. They led by three goals to nil. Carl Finnegan got us underway. Two goals from Jack Foley had us.